Hi guys, so I'm Stuck and today we are looking at caves, arches, stacks and stumps and what landforms does erosion create. Now in front of you is the picture of Old Harry Rocks and this is a classic example of um, all of these things put together. So first of all you've got to understand about hard and soft rock and about hard rock is much harder to erode than soft rock. So soft rock is very easy to erode and um, it is eroded by the facts of hydraulic action. Um, it is um, abrasion and solution as well, especially for limestone and things like that. Just watch my erosion video and you can learn more about that. However, what happens is in the headland there is normally some weaknesses in the cliff and the sea will attack the foot of a cliff and it will, will erode the, um, the areas um, of, the weak, of weakness. So it's a, a constantly attacking, usually with hydraulic action, which is the power of water, and it's eroding away these weaknesses. Then the cracks, uh, gradually, they get larger and then they form a small cave. So this is just a sea cave. It's not all the way through. We'll come on to what that is later. But it's just attacking and these weaknesses are getting bigger until it starts to use and make a little bit of a hole in the cliff. Um, so then the cave is widened and deepened until it cuts all the way through the headland and this then forms an arch. Um, a classic example of an arch is at Durdle Door, for example, where it's the water is eroded the whole way through until it has made an arch. Then, um, further undercutting causes the arch to collapse. Well, not all the time the cutting, but then it will cause the arch to collapse, and then you will remain with a stack. Now, so this this stack is going to be very hard rock because it has prevailed all of this um, erosion that's happened so it's going to be the hardest rock of them all and in, an interesting fact is in order to be a stack it has to be at least a third of the cliff's height um, but of course old and old Harry rocks in front of you the stack is a very dominant feature of it however if the um, stack collapses it will cause a stump which is just a little sort of boulder which you can barely see um, over the um, so the water. So thank you for watching. This was just part one, and please visit soon to see part two, which is going to be about wave cut notches and platforms. But for now, uh, see you soon. Make sure you visit my website. Um, the link will be below. Thanks for watching, and see you soon. Bye.